the first thing that should come to your mind is this, is that, you know, we were talking earlier about Tunguska and a, you know, 15 megaton bomb. Well, you drop a 15 megaton bomb, it's going to wipe out anything on the surface. But why, as part of our nuclear doctrine, do we put missile silos underground? Essentially, we bury them. Mm. Same with hardened command and control centers. Isn't it to hide it from like aerial surveillance or aerial? No, aerial detonations, aerial explosions, surface explosions of nuclear weapons. Remember in the, in the late 80s when we were developing that new generation of missiles like the Pershing II missiles, the Trident three missiles, mm -hmm. you know what they were designed to do? They were designed to penetrate up to 50 or 60 feet into the earth before exploding. Why? Because you had to do that if you're going to take out a missile silo or a command and control bunker, you've got to be able to explode them underground. So if you want to preserve a monument from an aerial explosion, bury it.